going out with Brian and Kate out of Hatteras, North Carolina, hoping to find us a white-faced storm petrel. We had some friends from Tennessee with us on the boat. We met Emma Price, a cute redhead from New Jersey, who was brandishing a new Canon R5 with deadly skill. It was quickly apparent that Emma's birding skills matched her camera skills. Tail tropic bird. Well, we're heading to New Jersey to try again for a white faced storm petrel. Getting ready to go out on an overnight 24 hour pelagic. There's our boat, the Starlight. Maybe we'll get our white faced storm petrel. I spotted this distant petrel zooming at us and yelled, Black Cap Petrel. Black Cap's a good bird in New Jersey, but I quickly realized that this was a much, much rarer bird. One of the rarest seabirds in the world and once believed to be extinct, the Bermuda Petrel. It took a bit to convince the New Jersey folks that it was real, a first state record for New Jersey. Got the white face storm petrol for a knife or something. Look at the beautiful petrol and now white face storm petrol. So incredible. When we're not seeing all these cool birds and breaking records, we're back home making money to pay for it all. Alan found a curly sandpiper out here at the Duck River Flats here in Tennessee a couple days ago. Then last night he refound it. And myself and some of my friends are out here and we're on it here, having a real fun time drinking and looks at a juvie, beautiful plumage juvie curly sandpiper. He's getting oil from his oil knob and oiling his feathers. Right there's my tracks in the mud where I came out here. And just over here in this block of shorebirds is a curly sandpiper. He's having a bath. So he is. I could use one of those right now. Curly sandpiper. Alan, who found it, leaving.